and coffee. So, photo browser here. We've uh, been using the phone for the last couple of months and uh, very happy with how smooth, quick, responsive it is. It's got a uh, full zoom player, all your music. Very easy to handle. And it's got, of course, all the uh, office applications. What's cool is you can uh, pick up these tiles. Like I can grab this and I can move this wherever I want it to be. So I can move it up here if I want. Pin it back in there. Okay. So you can create shortcuts of uh, contacts. Pretty standard, but it's neat that you get the photo with there. Bing Maps integration. It's got the Bing search integration. Okay. And then uh, obviously what we're here to talk about today is the, the game stuff right here. These are the games you would have on your phone. We'll have some spotlight games on your avatar right there. So Ron will go into more detail on what all is involved okay. in Xbox Live. So um, if you, so we'll talk about it. There are two big pieces of news here yeah. at Gamescom. The first is uh, we're announcing our uh, initial wave of launch titles yeah. that'll be coming uh, to Windows Phone 7. These are all Xbox Live enabled titles. Okay. Um, and we are announcing um, 50 titles that will be coming to the platform. And with all these titles, you can earn Xbox Live achievements yeah. um, and gamer score <laughs> that span uh, with your gamer score on the console. Yeah. Um, and we're also announcing the Xbox Live features that are going to be coming to Windows okay. 7, that's what I wanted to share with you. Okay, so perfect. From, from the Games Hub, you can uh, uh, you can download an application which gives you a view into your profile um, and also a 3D rendering of your avatar. And you can see here that uh, there are a number of animations for the avatar. This is my avatar looking sad. Um, and we've incorporated a number of uh, different animations. This is a, my avatar looking angry. Okay. Um, also, uh, you know, dancing around, um, clapping. We've also, if you're familiar with the carryables on the console, um, yeah. we've included a um, uh, carryables here on the phone. So you can see that my character has a warthog uh, okay. available on the console, and it's here. Um, and we've also uh, done some integration with the accelerometer. So if you uh, you know, shake the phone, um, you can see that your avatar will fall down. Okay. Um, and you can just pop him right back up. Um, we've also done work to integrate the avatar wardrobe. Okay. Um, just similar to what you have on the console. Um, you can go in and um, take a look at your avatar uh, in 3D, and you can uh, dress your avatar in um, you know, a number of different styles. Uh, you can pick a shirt or you know, another carryable. Any change that you make uh, yeah. to this on the phone, you can see on the console okay. um, and vice versa. Okay. Are they compatible, the clothes? Yes, okay. it's the same closet. So if I buy something on Xbox Live on my console, you I'll can have it, it on the yeah. phone as well. Yeah, one clarification is that here um, on the phone for the first version, we have the standard closet, okay. which is the, it has all free items in it. Okay. Um, you can also see that um, we've got the ability to update your profile here okay. right from the phone, and that will be reflective on the console as well. And then um, we've also included uh, your library of achievements. So this includes all the achievements that you've earned both on the console and the phone okay. all together. So you see the same view uh, as you have on the console. And uh, we've also integrated uh, a graphical representation of your friends list. Okay. You can see all of their avatars. Um, and just like on the console, you can see I'm most recently uh, played with. You can see here's some folks that I've most recently <laughs> okay. played with. If you uh, click on your uh, your friends, you can see who's online um, and who's offline and what their most recent activities were okay. on Xbox Live. And then um, I can click on uh, one of my friends and take a look at their profile. Um, I can also uh, take a look at all of the games that we have in common okay. um, and then how I've performed relative to my friend. And you can drill in and take a look at specific achievements okay. uh, for any of these games. And you can see the ones that are in color here are the ones that we've earned. Um, here's one that my friend has earned, but I haven't. And you can okay. see that his avatar is very happy, whereas <laughs> mine's not. looking sad. Yeah. Uh, and you can see here it gives you a hint on what you need to do to go earn that achievement. Uh, we've also incorporated uh, messages, so you have the ability to uh, send messages to your friends on the console, okay. um, and you're, you can message to the phone from the console as well. 
So it gives you an overview of, um, of what we have uh, coming to Xbox Live on Windows Phone 7. Uh, we're really excited about the feature set, particularly the avatar integration, because we think it'll really come alive for folks. And uh, so what we also want to do is share with you some of the details about the uh, first wave of titles coming okay. to the platform. Um, it's really a mix of a bunch of different uh, titles and genres. Uh, so we've got titles that have been successful on the console coming over, both um, on the console as well as Xbox Live Arcade. And then uh, we also have a, a number of very popular uh, titles, evergreen hits in mobile, so like Uno from Gameloft or uh, Bejeweled from PopCap. Okay. And, uh, and then we also have a number of up-and-coming titles uh, from uh, great developers that are building really interesting, 